Alright, so for my last video when I did the LK35, I showed this bag here. I just want to give you an idea uh, a bit more about this bag. So the front packet, pocket is really big. You can see there's space on the side here, but also just to give you an, a size comparison. At the moment I have a um, Yugoslavia mess kit in there and you can see you know, actually how big that pocket is. The side pockets are a little smaller with the same uh, locking and buckle set up there. And the same on the other side. You got a bit of a loop here if you want to put a hatchet or an axe or something. You can just strap that in there, which is good. Uh, same on that side as well. On top here, this doesn't come with it, but I showed this in my last video, and this is where I keep my big knife uh, away from the public so no one can see it. Um, and then on top here, I put a um, top here I put a big handle on it. It's like overkill, but it's a nice size handle. All right. So again, you have same locking buckles on this. You have that stuff sack, which is, is a bit that I put on my LK35 um, off the Bergen. So same principle. And then inside I just put, again, some foam to give this some shape here. So it's easy to get into and move around and stuff. Now, on the back of it, this, this bag doesn't come with uh, shoulder straps. So you can get shoulder straps for it, but I had a spare LK35 frame. So, but I used the same straps, so the straps are thin. So if I was gonna use this, I would use some thicker straps on this. This belt here, um, they, Military Mart made this belt, I think it was like 15 pounds for the LK35. And it has just a snap closure here, which you do have to redo and do again. Uh, that's the only thing I say about that. Um, that could have been done a little bit better on that. But um, yeah, so this is the straps they make for the LK35. The strap itself is uh, really good. You even have a little bit of molly on the side, which is nice. Uh, the frame itself, I put a bit of jute um, wrapped around here, just to, that if it's cold out, it's just something not cold, and also it's spare tinder if you need emergency tinder. Um, the way I attach this bag myself, I just put a, a cable tie um, from the top of the strap to the frame. You see the loops there. I do have the um, shoulder straps for this, but I prefer the LK35 uh, frame for it. Um, but yeah, it's just an overview of it. Um, again, the pockets on the sides are nice. It's good to end it. It's like, so if you didn't want to sew anything, like the LK35, you can just get one of these and they're pretty cheap themselves. I think it's about 20 pounds. So yeah, just give you guys an idea. Uh, let me know what you think about these type bags. Uh, material is pretty um, strong and decent. Uh, I doubt it's waterproof, but again, it's quite durable. Thanks guys for watching. I'll catch you next video. Bye.